Good morning. Welcome to 49ers in 5, your daily update on everything happening with the team that you need to know. I'm Rob Stats Guerrero. Today is Wednesday, April 24th, 2024. Here's what's happening with your San Francisco 49ers. With just one sleep to go before the NFL draft, the biggest story in 49ers land is still Brandon Ayuk. Mike Silver has an interesting column in the San Francisco Chronicle with a few juicy nuggets. According to, quote, knowledgeable sources inside the 49ers and high-ranking executives and coaches around the league, a trade of Ayuk is still very possible. Here's what Silver knows. First, the Niners did reach out to another team in early April about trading Brandon Ayuk. That other team reportedly did not engage. So far, according to Silver sources, the Niners have been asking for a first-round pick, but league executives think a high second and a third-round pick in 2025 could be enough to get a deal done. Ayuk could, of course, be traded on Thursday, but Silver says he could also be traded during rounds two and three of the draft and that we can't rule out that possibility. And again, this is all according to Mike Silver and his sources. Finally. Brandon Ayuk wants a deal, quote, well over $25 million a year. Remember, that is exactly what Devontae Smith just signed for with the Philadelphia Eagles. Three years, $75 million. So Ayuk wants, quote, well over that. Now, look, is he doing the thing where you always ask for more than you know you're going to get? And so he knows eventually it'll probably be around $25 million. Who knows? This is just what Mike Silver is reporting. Also. Interesting little nugget in the story. Debo Samuel, quote, has been assured by his bosses that he will not be dealt during or after the draft. That's an interesting little nugget. That means apparently at one point Debo must have inquired about whether or not he was going to be traded, right? I mean, I think we all kind of thought financially it made more sense for him to stick with the Niners. But if you look at his contract after June 1st, the cap hit for trading Debo was only $6.6 million. So financially, they probably could have done it. But it appears that they are keeping the band together in that aspect for at least one more season. We always give you one thing to read, one thing to watch, and one thing you might have missed. One thing to read on this Wednesday. If you want some good Brandon Ayuk news, his personal wide receiver coach, TJ Hushmanzada, was on with 95-7 the game. Hushmanzada said Ayuk doesn't want to leave the 49ers. He just wants to get paid. If you want to read more of his quotes, click the link in the description of this episode. One thing to watch, you heard me talk about it earlier this week. Ross Tucker joined the show yesterday. I wanted to get into with Ross, what makes a good offensive lineman? Because the Niners are probably going to take one. Ross played in the league for the better part of a decade. What's good, what's fixable, and what's not? So Ross broke that all down. It is up on the YouTube channel. If you want to watch it, again, click the link in the description of this episode. One thing you may have missed, if you're one of those 49er fans that wants to get revenge on the Chiefs and Patrick Mahomes and Andy Reid, guess what? You're going to get your chance because the Chiefs announced earlier this week that Andy Reid and general manager Brett Veach have contract extensions that run through 2029. So guess what? They're keeping the band together in Kansas City. And chances are, if Kyle Shanahan wants a Super Bowl, he's going to have to figure out how to beat the Andy Reid-Patrick Mahomes combo. Reid, by the way, to his credit, is reportedly now the highest paid head coach in the National Football League. That's a wrap on today's 49ers and 5. Please rate, review, and follow the Gold Standard Podcast Network. Like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click the bell to get notified every time we go live which is every single weekday for you. I will be alive today with Grant Cohn, 9 a.m. Pacific time. Wake up with us, get some coffee, plenty of IU rumors to break down. And remember, we are going to be live during the NFL draft. Me, Levin, Steph Sanchez, hopefully Vish Kumar as well. We will do a live draft show for you. So again, click the bell. We will be at the ready. Niners move up in the first round. Bam, we'll be there. Niners stay at 31. Bam, we'll be there. Niners trade back. We'll be really mad because we'll be sitting around all night for nothing. But whatever happens, spend part of your draft with us. I promise we will make it worth your while. Enjoy the rest of your Wednesday, everybody. I'm Rob Stats Guerrero. We'll talk later today.